In this video, I will show you how you can place long and short orders when you're leverage trading on the platform Bitflex. If you want to create an account on Bitflex, you can use the link down from the video description. You will get to exactly this page right here and you will be eligible for all the best sign up bonuses that you can get up to $100 here. You can participate in different giveaways and also get some other sign up bonuses. They change over the different months, but by using the link, you will always get the best bonuses possible. You can simply enter your email address right here, give a password and then you're ready to go. Once we have created an account, the first thing we have to do is to deposit money. We can do that by simply going up here to our assets, click on deposit. Then you can choose the cryptocurrency right here, such as Bitcoin, Ethereum or US dollar Tether. Choose a network and then you will get your deposit address right here where you can send money to uh, from your exchange or another wallet. To leverage trade with the money, we definitely need US dollar Tether here. So I would recommend just deposit US dollar Tether. If you don't have it yet and you're depositing, for example, Bitcoin, you can easily convert it up here. Just go to trade, click on convert and you can choose, for example, from Bitcoin to US dollar Tether. Type in your amount and then you will have US dollar Tether here to trade with it. Now I want to show you the leverage trading platform. You can get to it by just going up here and clicking on derivatives. You will get to this layout right here. You can choose your trading pair up here. You will see the price chart right here. You can get rid of all of these uh, lines by just clicking on the X right here. So you just see the chart. You can choose the different time frames right here. You can see the order book. You can see the recent trades that have happened in the market. If you scroll down here, we can see our open positions later on. Here you can see your assets. If you don't see them yet here, you can click on transfer and transfer them from your spot account where you have deposited or converted the money and to your derivatives account, you need USDT. Type in the amount, you will see your amount right here that's uh, transferable and then you have it on here. And then once you see it here, you can now leverage straight with it. If you scroll up a bit, we can now open some orders here. And first of all, I wanna show you how you can open long positions. So you have two different options, a limit or a market order. I first will show you how a limit order works. A limit order means you don't enter the position right now immediately, but you can set a certain price at which you want the order to be executed. For example, I don't want the order to be opened now, but only if the price reaches, for example, 30,200. So I can type in here, 30,200, that's the order price at which it will be triggered. Then I can set a leverage up here. We can uh, choose between a 2x leverage up to 100x. In this case, let's leave it at 2x. Now we can type in the amount or the quantity of the trade. You can switch the displayment here by Bitcoin or US dollar tether. I will stick with US dollar tether because it's better to see. And then you can see your balance down here and you can type in how much of that you wanna use in that trade. Either you can use the slide controller. For example, if I go to 100%, this amount equals this amount. Or I could type in, for example, I want 100 US dollar tethers and then I can open my long position. That's pretty much all I have to decide. If I click on here, I can also see the final position size. Of course, it's my $100. It's a little bit less because uh, it's actually calculated in Bitcoin and there's only three digits after the decimal point. So in this case, it doesn't match exactly, but you can see, okay, it's around about $100. And down here, this is the entire order value, which is of course my own capital, which I've put into the $100 times two, because I'm using a two X leverage equals around about $200 of entire value position. I can also see my estimated liquidation price and all I have to do then is just click on confirm and as you will see nothing really happens I don't see a position down here because I used a limit order if I go down here to active orders I can see it it hasn't been filled yet it's still active but it waits until the price of $30,200 is reached and only then it will open as a position and will be displayed in here Let's cancel this position. I wanna show you how you can enter the market immediately, which I would recommend you and I always do all the time too. Just use a market order. Then you will enter the market immediately at the current market price. Let's do it. We can click here, open market, choose the market price. Now let's say we are using a 5X leverage this time. Let's choose US dollar tether as amount as well. And let's just go for 100% and use all of our own capital that we have in here. Now let's click on open long, we can check this is now five times our own capital, so it's a $670 um, position. Um, we can see our estimate liquidation price, which is now a little bit higher because we're using a higher leverage. And we can click on confirm. What you will see now is directly down here, we can see our open position. We can see here on the left, it's a long position because this and this is green. We will see later on how it looks for a short position. 
we can see we are using a 5x leverage. This is the position size in Bitcoin and in US dollar tether. We can see our entry price, the current price, our liquidation price. So if we don't have a, a stop loss and the position goes so much down and reaches this price for our long position. So we are this much in negative. Of course, we're making money if the price goes up. So if the price goes down, we are making um, a loss. So if it goes down this much to this price, then our entire position will be liquidated, which means it will be closed at this price and we will lose our entire margin in this trade, which we can see here. This is our margin, so this means this is our own capital in this trade. We can, if you click on here, we can even either increase it to move our liquidation price further down or decrease it to move it further up. So you can choose that in here and switch up these different numbers. Um, here you can see your unrealized profit or loss. So in this case, the price went down a little bit. So we are down 11 cents in this trade for now. Here on the right, you can also add a take profit or stop loss. So if you click on here, we can now say, all right, if the price goes up a certain amount of percent, for example, if it goes up 10%, it will automatically calculate the price for you. You could also type it in manually, but in this case, it goes up 10% to this price. We will make $66 of profit, which means return on invest of around about 50%. Of course, this is 10%. The price moves up 10%. We're using a 5x leverage in this position here. So that means, of course, 50% profit for us. And by our numbers, it means $66 because we are around about $140 in this position. Same goes for stop loss. Let's say the price goes down 2%. I will make a $13, $13 loss at this price and it means minus 10%. I can click on confirm and I've set these two numbers, my take profit and my stop loss. Unfortunately, I can't see them in the chart right here. It doesn't really matter. I can always see them down here and I can edit them at any point if I wanna switch up these numbers. I can always see how the numbers behave, click on confirm and I've changed that up. So that's pretty much all there is to know about the take profit and stop losses. Pretty simple. Um, I can leave the position open now, wait until either one of these two is hit or of course at any point, maybe the price goes up a little bit and I wanna take some profits. I can always close the position manually as well. Just go here, click on market. You can choose how much of the position you wanna be closed. Well, for example, take half of the profit. In this case, I wanted to close the entire position. Just click on confirm and then you have closed the position. Now I wanna show you how it also works for a short position. In this case, we are gonna use a market order again. Just click on market. Let's say in this time we're going to use a 10x leverage, even a higher leverage, just to demonstrate. Here I will choose US dollar tether again. And let's say I want to go in with $100 in this case. I'm just going to click on open short. As you can see, $100 of my own money because I'm using a 10x leverage. That means $1,000 entire position size and also the BTC value increased. My liquidation price in this case is of course above it because we're using a short position. So now we are making money if the price goes down and we are losing money if the price goes up. So if it goes up to 33,000 and we don't have a stop loss set at this position, our position will be liquidated and we will lose our own margin. In this case, the $100. So let's click on confirm. And it pretty much looks all the same. If you scroll down a little bit, we can see now this is red. So that means it's a short position. We can see our leverage value, liquidation price, of course, as we've seen. And um, of course, now it works the opposite way around. If it goes down, we're making profit. If it goes up, we're making a loss. And we can, of course, add it a take profit and stop loss again. Um, now the take profit, of course, is if the price goes down. So the take profit needs to be below our entry price. So let's say our take profit, um, if the price goes down, as you can see, if, as I increase this number, the price gets lower and lower because of course we're making more profit the lower the price goes. As you can see, for example, if it goes down 90%, we would make $900 of profit and 900% of profit. So as you can see, the lower it goes, of course, the more profit we're making. Let's say the price goes down like, I don't know, 8%. Um, we would make $77 of profit. Um, and let's say the price goes up uh, to 3%, we want to go out at this price, it calculates the prices automatically, or we could also type it in manually, and uh, we would make $30 of a loss. Let's click on confirm, and we've set these two numbers. As you can see, the price has dropped a little bit now, and we already made like 20 cents profit. Um, all right, let's close the position as well. I think I've shown you everything, take a little bit of a profit, and that's pretty much all you need to know about opening, closing, adding, take profit and stop loss, both for long position and a short position. Don't forget to create an account on Bitflex by using the link down from the video description to get the best sign up bonuses possible. And of course, as always, if you have any other questions, feel free to ask them in the comments.